Okay guys, um, thank you very much, this graphics once again and today I'm going to teach you how to solve some few Adobe um, extension issues whereby sometimes you install some extensions and you want to use it but it doesn't work. For instance, let's proceed. Guys, if you have not subscribed to my channel, try to subscribe to my channel. Let's proceed with today's um, um, tutorial. Okay, so what we just do, for instance, you go to um, Windows and you come to extension and this is the extension that I've installed and I want to open but when you click you see this information the so so and so extension could not be loaded because it was not properly signed and you can see this kind of information over here now we are going to solve this if you have ever come across with this I'm going to give you a simple way of solving this particular issue so what you are going to do is let's close this one then you come to the search then you type regis yeah registry yeah you can see that it has even popped up editor so you come to open then you open the registry editor then what you are going to do is guys over here it might be a little bit of confusion so you should take your time and follow me step by step so what you do is you come to the second one which is each key current user so you click this one then from there you go to software so you search for software here is software and under software you see um adobe so you click on adobe so when you click on adobe under the adobe you see cx and uh, cs this particular one then you come and uh, click on it now with this one that you are you are seeing over here i want to explain something over here now when you see this csxs when you see CXX like this and you are seeing 3, that means that it's CS6, that's the Adobe version. When you see 4, it, mean, it means that uh, it's uh, CC2014. Uh, when you see um, the one with the number 6, for instance, this one with the number 6, it means that 2016, CC2016. When you see 7, that means 2017. When you see 8, it means that 2018. When you see 9, it means 20. 19 when you see 10 it means 2020 when you see 11 it means 2021 so when you see 12 you should just imagine 2022 okay so this will tell you that i am using 2019 version of the adobe uh, photoshop okay so most of us might see maybe cxxs 9 8 6 7 that means that you have installed more than one adobe photoshop um, versions on your machine but if you see only one over here and it has this nine over here that means that you are using the 20 cc 2019 version so that i'm using this so what you are going to do is the best thing that you are going to do over is you come over here then you left click go to new then click on string value here then you type player please type as i have typed debug player debug mode sorry player debug mode like this then you come to modify then you type in the value the value just type only one then press ok guys that's all so what you do is you close so if you have different versions like maybe csxs.9.7.8 that means that you have to do the same thing for all of them so you just close this one then come and close your um, photoshop okay once that is open over here you go to your windows back again you go to extension then you come to the fs box and guys see now it has opened so it didn't give us that information that it was giving us again so as you can see i come back again and then couldn't come back again so guys if you haven't subscribed to my channel subscribe to my channel as you see this video to be helpful and share this to your friends thank you very much and have a blessed day bye bye